You can't talk about the Abrams without saluting that 120 millimeter cannon. It can shoot a shell through 10 feet of solid concrete. The first step to installing it is putting the breech into the turret. The breech holds the gun tube. It's maneuvered carefully into place. On the first try, they slid two tons of steel into the turret without touching the edge. That's impressive. That breach isn't gonna budge, thanks to Vinny. I really take pride in the work and what it is that I'm doing here. You know, because it's the finest thing built in the world. For a lot of guys here, it's not a job, it's a mission. Here comes the business end of the gun. Back in 1980, the gun was 105 millimeters. Today, it's the big boy, a 120 millimeter smooth bore cannon. They used to be made in Germany, but the cannons are now manufactured at the nation's oldest yet most modern weapon factory, Watervliet Arsenal in upstate New York. The tube is shipped to Aberdeen, Maryland for live fire testing. And then it hops a rail car ride right here to Ohio. It fires a variety of ammunition, including some made from depleted uranium. Again, they hoist it up and with surgical precision, drop it in the slot. One gun tube locked, but not loaded. 